Hello everyone, back again with another video, this time talking about the book Murtag by Christopher Paulini. Uh, this is going to be spoiler free, so don't worry about any of that. Just wanted to give my thoughts on the book. It was one of, I think, technically four titles I was excited to come out this year yeah the three five five uh, uh, the three uh cosmere titles from brandon sanderson secret projects fractal noise also by christopher paulini and this one and it did not disappoint i started reading the inheritance cycle when i was in high school not to make myself or uh christopher feel older <laughs> and I and to think 10 years after graduating high school we get yet another book in that series uh, Tales of Allegasia which was a collection of three short stories that Christopher had put out before this uh, it felt like a nice Quick visit back home uh, in a way but with Martag this feels like coming home to a familiar place and staying a while it was one heck of a journey uh, definitely an emotional roller coaster in places Finally getting to delve into Murtag as a character, like actually be inside his head and just seeing some of the things he'd endured both prior to and during uh, the Inheritance Cycle. And just, wow, that's all I can say. <laughs> uh, it's not the official... Book 5, I will choose to call it Book 4.5, but it's it's well worth the read to anyone who has read The Inheritance Cycle. It's both, it both feels familiar and also you can, like, you can tell that Christopher has had a good 10 years of learning and writing like, between uh, Inheritance and Murtag. I don't even know if I'm pronouncing his name completely correctly. There's a pronunciation guide in the back. Maybe I can uh, find it and hopefully not uh, accidentally spoil things. Uh, do, 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 do. Oh, you're at the... Uh, Mer tag. Okay, yeah, I had it right. Like I said, it's been about 10 years since I've read The Inheritance Cycle. And this book definitely makes me want to go back and reread them. Uh, but yes, you can definitely tell that he's grown as a writer, that Christopher has grown as a writer in the 10 years it's been. Well, actually, I think... Uh, Inheritance was a 2011 book. So, 12 years? 12 years between these two books? So. But yes, I very much enjoyed this novel. I am looking forward to... <clears throat> excuse me. I am looking forward to more Tales of Allegasia, which he has indicated in his acknowledgments that there will be more. And I, like many, look forward to the eventual Book 5. The official Book 5. And, uh... As one final comment that I want to leave to Christopher himself, if he somehow is watching this. Which... I don't even want to think about that. Uh, one final comment to Christopher, if he's watching this. Please, 
please tell me that there is a dragon rider and dragon therapist on Mount Arngor. <laughs> or that there will be at some point. Because my god. These two. Oh, these two need one. <laughs> so, so bad. <laughs> uh, anyways, that's all for me for now. I will see you guys in the next video. A and on a serious note, if he does somehow happen to be watching this, thank you so much, Christopher, for the books. This one especially. It's nice to be home again. Thank you all. Have a good day.